Hi everyone, Cinder here. Welcome back to more Epic Battle Fantasy V. Here we are at the equipment shop before we head east to the right. I am going to buy, I really thought about buying Black Thing, but bio skills, mm, don't use too much, but it'd be cool for Matt to have a sword instead of a hockey stick. <laughs> So I'm really debating on that. Or I could buy Nurse Hat, Genji Armor. Nurse Hat boosts power of healing spells. Genji Armor for boosting the earth damage skills. And a Nurse Uniform for Natalie. Boost power of healing spells. We only have one healing spell right now. Um, we only have 1,800 cash. So I've been kind of going back and forth, and I'm going to go with the Nurse Hat, Genji Armor, and Nurse Uniform. I could also buy that Army helmet. Hmm. Festive accessory. Okay, surprise present! <laughs> Candy canes. Sure. We're gonna buy that too. I you are not Oh hair accessory. I just read accessory. Ah, that's my fault. Oh well. Nurse hat instead of the um, red ribbon, although I really do like the red ribbon the way it looks. Boost the power of healing spells, make that healing spell count. And nurse uniform. So, because Natalie typically heals a lot for me. <laughs> and the Genji armor. Lose some death and doom resistance, but if enemies start insta-casting, you know, trying to insta-kill us, we'll put that back on. Uh, a shuriken and a brick. Oh, we can upgrade it. That's good. I upgraded Natalie's druid staff. It gave it 5 HP and 5 defense, uh, 5 magic defense, and 10 and 10 attack magic attack. I can't upgrade it again. Steals items with single target melee attacks. Done. Make it level 3. Make it stronger. Yay, the Ultra Pro, Pro 9000X. Okay. Cupcake. Oh, wait. Two apples to reduce ally cooldowns by one. Man, I really like that item, but. Or upgrade the armor. Oh, one more thing before we before we head out. We can upgrade the clover, but it takes all the geodes, and who knows, a skill or something might need it. So I'm going to hold off on that. Just in case you're wondering. Let's go! Okay. Hey, Matt, stuff is really going down. This old bridge is out. The only way to cross the water now is by raft. And ironically, the raft maker lives on the other side of the water. So we ain't getting no rafts, man! Everything's gonna be fine. We know how to get across. We're just gonna go through the ice cave. We? Who's the girl? And the cat? Are you ditching me again? Why can't we ever hang out? Well, uh... Maybe some other time. <laughs> maybe some other time. <laughs> Have we collected every type of fetish outfit yet? Bet you guys are loving this, perverts. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I was just thinking healer, <laughs> like like the the uh, healer slash white mage that I am. I was just thinking about oh healing, boost healing spells. Did it? I didn't even think about the whole the very cute Natalie being in in a nurse outfit. Good one, game. <laughs> Sand foes. <laughs> Sand slime. Sandstone boulder. Weak to ice. Hmm. 
got one. Sand slime. Ow, don't hit Natalie. Heads up! Hey, hey, don't touch me. You mess up my hair. Sandstorm. Oh, because it's dry. Fire and bomb damage taken increased by 50%. Thunder and ice damage reduced by 50%. But water damage is still good. I don't have water damage. But... Let's go jump attack. Yeah. Jump attack. Heal! 778! You're fine! What the hell? What is it, sand? Some kind of sticky pudding stuff! <laughs> uh, poison. Oh, you were surrendering. Can't heal again. Us can be great against Rocky and Dry Foes, and if we're lucky enough to freeze a foe, we can hit it for double damage. Nice. Disappointed. <laughs> Alright, you gotta go now. Got it. Level up that the sandstorm really helps them. Okay, now that we have an idea what we're going up against. Cactus dress. Embrace and show off your love for cacti. Boost the damage of bio skills. And three cactus. All about cactus there. Summit. Use a basic bio attack which may stun a single target. Leaps at a single target and deals massive physical earth damage. Okay. I mean, power 330. Massive is right. It take all the SP we have. Increase evade and accuracy. Increase health points. It's always the same, but it because it increases by I was thinking about this, because it increases by percentage. Do I get more out of it when if I were to use it later? It says I don't need to save it for later, I understand. Or is that 2% always there? So even when we level, we get that extra 2%. I'm, I'm having I'm not explaining that very well. Maybe you get what I'm what I'm saying, and you can answer answer me in the comments. So I think that's what it's going to do, and I'm failing miserably right now. Skills! Advanced magic, which hits a single target. Element and effect depend on current weapon. So because she's using the druid staff, it'll be bio. Upgrade lucky star... Natalie's stuff is expensive. 300 AP for Holy Light. Uh, we can mute. Mute an enemy. That might be useful. Star Power costs a hundred. Buff an ally's magic attack. Heal heals for a lot right now. <laughs> Holy attack. Slicing Cyclone hits all enemies several times. Element and effects depend on current weapon. Hmm. That's tempting. Slicing Cyclone. Spend all the AP on that. For 
no legs. Star Blast, even though it has a really long cooldown, just because I think it's interesting. We need Bubbly Strike and Wispy Strike. We don't have anything that really does Dark Element yet. Clears the weather for five turns. That's the magical holy damage to all enemies. Tempting. Yeah, we're gonna learn the creator. Have another limit break. Okay, that's a lot of elements covered. Yay. Next. Puppies! Huh? Why are we in battle positions? <laughs> That's rescue dog. We do need the rescue dog. Scan. A dog that just wants to protect its allies. It will heal itself at low health and try to de-escalate the violence with buffs. Weak to poison and dark. That's weak enough. I have no legs hit it again. Sandy Bush, a bush that settled down in the desert. It sometimes yearns for its childhood spent tumbling along. It goes one. Dodge! What if one of us gets rabies from a bush? <laughs> that would be embarrassing. At the okay. Rescue dog. And. Oh, critical! Well, next time! <laughs> Whoops! Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's five! Let's go turn these things in. Yay! Turning in side quest episode. <laughs> Not only that, I promise. Yes. Oh, I'm missing the left sock still. Hey. There it is. Skill encore gives an ally an extra turn. Using this on yourself is pointless. <laughs> yeah, because you're using your turn to give yourself an extra turn, so you just still have your basic turn. Yogurt and coffee. Found them all? You're giving them to me? Thanks a bunch. We do lose the rescue dog, but we can get another rescue dog. No, you found me? He doesn't look very fierce. I'll try to train him, I guess. Purify. Heals the common status problems of either ally, all allies or all foes. Does not include neutral statuses like wet or dry. It has to be, like, poison, virus, things like that. That's interesting. You can heal all foes. Why would you want to do that? Well, we've seen the worms, for example, be able to have poison on themselves. But they absorb poison, so it acts like regen for them. They're taking poison damage, but they're healing from it. With Purify, we can get rid of that. It counts as a status problem, but for them, it's helping them. Garlic and a fried egg to increase mass health.
we're gonna take this fight again. Because we have two things we need to try to get. Don't like that it says enslaved. <laughs> I mean, we are capturing it, but anyway, just leave it as like capturing Pokemon. Everything is fine. I may not be a physical fighter, but whacking foes unleashes the special effects of my staffs? True enough. He's a good little boy. Can we keep him as a pet? Yes. Yes, we can. But I can't target him right now. Darn it. I forgot to put on the skill, too. Uh. Oh, that was fun. Nobody to blame but myself on that one. Defend. Drinking in the middle of a battle? This duck could be my friend if he weren't my enemy. One more turn. There we go. I was worried for a second, but I probably shouldn't have been. Gives the lovable status to all allies, making enemies hesitant to attack them directly. Cool. Hisses viciously at the enemy, viciously at the enemies, debuffing their magic defense slightly. <laughs> So, uh, Natalie. Yeah? What's up? What sort of things are you into? Like, uh, hobbies, I mean. You like video games? Because I do. Um, I've been playing a lot of addictive puzzle games on my phone lately. I've also got a DS with a bunch of mystery solving games. Those are really fun to play while I'm traveling. Cool, Natalie. That's cool. Oh, I don't like puzzle games. Those kind of suck in my opinion. Whatever. <laughs> All kinds of, of different games out there. That's one of the beauty about video games. There's lots of lots of different different types out there for lots of people to enjoy. Not sure what this thing is, but it looks like it would eat all of your snacks if it got the chance. Guess that problem is taken care of now. <laughs> looks like this bird got what it deserved. Birds, man. They're always throwing themselves into the side of my house. Yeah, yeah, they, they tend to do that. <laughs> nice. Very nice. <laughs> uh, I see you over there. Aha! There's something hidden back here. <laughs> almost missed this one. Really? We're gonna steal from this friendly family? I'm sorry, Natalie, but this is just how the game is played. I'm sure you'll get used to it eventually. <sighs> I'm gonna make this right someday. I swear. Gold key. Uses to remove a single gold block from the Grand Gallery and a gold plate. Which looks... <laughs> looks kind of like a jiggy. <laughs> a pretty material which signifies wealth. Not very strong though. And sushi! Increase the snow legs attack and defense by 2. 2%. Nice. Bring me the stuff. You there, traveler. You emerged from the depths of the jungle, did you not? She happened for a chance to have some spare lumber. I'd like to rebuild these totems that were destroyed by the shaking land. Wooden idol. And soft. Okay. Is that a summon? 
It is a summon. I'll need to go get a wooden idol. Another wooden idol. Thank you, Traveler. May your kindness carry you far in this world. Maybe you'll count. Rice Ball. Increase no likes magic attack and magic defense. Star Ball. A mysterious orange ball that fell from the sky. If all these are collected, something may happen. Oh, man. We can summon the magical, da uh, the magical dragon, Starlight. Wait, that doesn't sound quite right. Close enough. Ivy. Bio attack. Which hits a single target, may poison. Okay, skills. You already have a bio attack. We'll give this to no legs. Bonus skills! Metal and achievement unlock. Natalie will get purify. No legs will get encore. Can have somebody like Matt go again and swing twi twice for yes. Or have, or have Natalie go twice and heal. I, I can hit these targets no problems, but fast enemies still give me some trouble. I guess it's hard to hit enemies that are at a higher level than me. And, well, I'm level zero. Also, flying enemies. They tend to dodge attacks quite well. Sniping skills come in handy sometimes. We'll keep an eye out on our accuracy stat. As I understand it, if your accuracy is higher than a foe's evade, you can't miss. Well, with the exception of a very few skills that have extra low accuracy. Good to know. And remember, quick slash. Sorry. And super flash slash. <laughs> Swift slash, which is a super fast slash. Easier for me to say. Have really high accuracy. I'm gonna go ahead and give that to, to Matt, just in case. I'm worried about my grandfather. He doesn't believe in modern medicine, so he doesn't take any coffee with him while hunting. He won't be able to revive his fallen allies without coffee! Unless you got a powerful healer in your party, carrying some garlic is also very important. Never know when you can be poison stunned or worse. Oh, I really like garlic though. I don't think my cat likes it either. Well, one more little tip. One more little tip for you. If you're unfamiliar with status effects, you can see a list of them in the stats and equips menu. Just hover over them to see their names. Cool. Burn and Scorch, Stun, Chill and Freeze, Poison and Virus, Weak and Tired, Dispel, Doesn't. You are a warp cat. Neat. A chili pepper. Nice. Hold on to that. Wooden idol. Great. Ah, critical. Okay, this, the face is the same. I was like, but I wanted that face. But it's always, always looks like that. Now that's teamwork. What if we tried stacking up like that to attack? Hmm, that'd be interesting. But I don't think Natalie would be down. Let's see. I know I have a fire attack. If you can dry the foes from me, I'll hit them with a fireball for massive damage. Oh, uh that makes sense. <laughs> oh man, that makes these enemies really funny to fight. Um, let's see. Let's see Star Blast. <laughs> Achievement unlock, cooling off. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> You've got awesome taste in attack, no Lex. I gotta say. Kinda reminds me of one of my favorite characters in Starlight's bestest friend. I know you have a fire attack. 
Fire spells work well against plants, animals, and ice foes. Makes sense. Natalie's just full of great knowledge. Ow, critical time soon. Yay, regen. And now you're all done. Goodbye. And that's a level up for our girl, Natalie. Chicken leg. Permanently increases Matt's accuracy and evade by 1%. Sapphire Saint. An intricately crafted blade. Boosts damage of water skills. It has 50% water element. Uh, we need a glass shard. We can do that. May unleash whirlpool while attacking. Oh, we can actually upgrade that again. Hey, there's some shops near here, right? I think this is a good chance to grab any healing items we're short on. And upgrade some equipment. Oh, get some stacks for no legs, too. <laughs> What do you mean? Are you saying she'd make a better leader than me? Are you gonna betray me already, no legs? Don't regret don't make me regret not eating you. That's a horrible thing to say to your pet! You can't treat no legs like that! Oh, she's mad. <laughs> I'm totally just kidding. Right, no legs? Stare. <laughs> Hey, no legs. Beware, a boss has been spotted down south. Remember to buy some snacks before heading into a tough battle. The starfish market has your needs covered, and it's just one screen west from here. How useful! Let's take a look at the shop before we end the episode. Oh, it brings us back here. Cool. More sushi and more... That's good. It brings us back here in case you need to buy some stuff. I mean, we spent a bunch of our money, so... steel plate for, for no legs. And if the enemy's weak to water, we go bandit blade. And that'll that'll be good. Oh yeah, the cardboard box. Increases the effect of buff skills used. You needed the banana. Like, there was something I could upgrade. Six coffee and two uh, satin. Really posh material used for dresses and such. So, cactus dress. Randomly cast cactus between turns. Hmm. I'd rather the heal spells be, be good. Okay. I don't know what we're going to find in the future. Three cactus and two jungle flower. So I'm hesitant to... To take a... To upgrade some abilities. Some things. Just in case. Alright, one more thing. What's over here? No man's land. We can't get that treasure chest. Can't go that way anyway. Grab the treasure chest and then we're done. 
I don't consider Gones to be alive. You can beat these guys, guys up all you want, and I won't complain. Go. Cool. <laughs> Keep the limit break because there's a boss coming up. Hey, we the water element. Nice, not bad. Star blast. Where'd you find that warp star, no legs? I want one too! Yay, Kirby! If you didn't uh, get the reference earlier. <laughs> also, Angry Birds on the, uh, with the bird that keeps flying into the house. I think I covered everything now. You're gonna surrender. Bye! Ow. Yeah, the ow. <laughs> oh, now you're weak to fire. Oh, so close. Ha! Ah, stop hitting that. It's throwing turd balls. I'm not even joking now. Tired. Evade and accuracy decreases every turn. Bio damage taken is increased by 50%. That thing goes twice. An extra turn? I got this. I'm always thinking a few turns ahead. Because she's super smart. Heal. The drive. That's fine. This fight's over. This fire gets rid of the dry status effect. Cool. Grab the treasure. A seashell and two steel plates. Hey! Boost damage to non-elemental skills. Also, five more H uh, plus five HP, plus ten attack, magic attack, five defense, five magic defense. Let's go! Upgrade the buckler. Counter attacks with blade blitz. Sounds cool. We can also upgrade them. Randomly cast Cat Warrior between turns. That sounds useful. I like the way the that armor looks, so we're going to stick with it for just a little bit. Oh, wrong way. Sorry. That's going to do it for this episode. We're going to... I'm going to heal the party. And next time, boss. So, there are achievements for beating the bosses on Epic, like that guy at the uh, Grand... I already forgot the name of the place. <laughs> the place right here. The Grand Gallery. There we go. Oh, I can, like, mark. Mark them. Cool. Um, at the Grand Gallery. And some of you in the comments have also told me. <laughs> so, I've been debating how to do it. We're playing on, a, playing on a hard. I might do boss battles twice. Like, save before boss battles, and then do them twice. Do them once on hard, and then once on epic. Just for the achievement. Um, haven't decided. That's what I'm debating on. Is, is that. But, like I said, that's good for this episode. We'll beat up this enemy, uh, these two enemies. Move the block around, get treasure chest. And next time, head, uh, head toward the boss. Said the boss down south, so see what that entails. Until then, I'm Sindre9. Remember to shoot for the stars and take care, everyone.